Hello, Kelsey Taylor here. Hello, Kelsey Taylor here. <laughs> widescreen my ass. This doesn't look like widescreen on in the screen here. Um, well, anyway, um, in case you couldn't tell, um, I'm testing out the new HD camera that I got for Christmas. Well, the webcam, because um, I have another one that um, is in full screen, shit quality, shit audio. Um, this is basically just a test. Um, I don't know what else to do, but um, since this is a test, I gotta do something um, worthwhile. Um, like, like I said, this is a test to check out how this webcam works. Um, and um, I pretty much decided to show you some of the DVDs I have gotten over the past few months since I've done my um, DVD collection video back in October. Now, some of these I've shown before, um, but um, these are the ones that I've gotten over the last few months that have been recently added to my collection that I thought you'd like to see. Now, this won't be a regular thing. Um, I'll still do reviews on these, but I just want to show you what I've gotten over the last few months. Now, um, these three, um, if you saw my Christmas haul video, um, you would have seen I've gotten these for Christmas. I got um, the Muppet Christmas Carol, make sure I, they're in frame, the Angry Vegan Nerd movie, and the Page Master. Which, like all these, I still have to review, like I mentioned before. And a lot of these I haven't got to watch yet, but um, I've seen 95% of them before. So, um, the Page Master, I don't think I've seen. So, yeah, those are the ones I got for Christmas. Now, here are the ones that um, you probably have no idea that I picked up. Now, um, these bunch I picked up from Walmart. Um, a few I got from the Goodwill, and a few I got from Target. Um, like I said, these are from the past few months I picked up. Um, I got, and for very cheap prices too. Um, there are a bunch I got from the $3 to $5 bins. And um, I'll go through them just quickly. They're not regular for just showing you the DVDs I've gotten over the last few months. Um, I got End of Watch, which I thought was a pretty awesome movie. Um, occasionally I like watching the show Cops. This is basically um, like um, Cops the movie, but this is pretty, pretty interesting, pretty cool. I can't wait to watch it again and do a review. Um, the next one I got from Walmart is Deepwater Horizon and Patriot's Day, which are the Mark Wahlberg P. Burr collaborations. I'm trying to find Lone Survivor, but for some reason Walmart didn't have it in the $5 bin. So, um, and I couldn't find it at Target either, so I guess it's one of those situations where I have to get off online. Or I guess somewhere else, I don't know. But um, I like pretty much almost everything that the two have done, um, except for Mile 22. I haven't even seen that one yet, but that's the recent one they've done. And I also got from Walmart um, The Fault in Our Stars, which I'm going to have to watch again and review pretty soon, but I liked it a lot, but the ending, oh my god, when I do the review, I'll tell you so much. Like, I don't know if I should spoil the ending, but, but the latest movie that made me cry hard. And the next one is uh, my new favorite Ron Williams movie, Good Morning Vietnam. I got it in the um, Walmart three dollar bin. Well, it's three seventy four, but you know what I mean. And this one I got for um, almost ten dollars at Walmart as well. Um, I completed um, the Maze Runner trilogy. I have all of them. I got the third one, the Maze Runner um, De Death Cure or Maze Runner De Death Cure. There's no the for Maze Runner. And um, I do have the other one I got from the Goodwill show in a few seconds. I also got Baby Driver. Um, and the last one I got from Walmart, um, like a couple weeks ago, is The Martian. Now, um, I've learned in the month of December, do not buy movies for yourself. Save money to buy gifts for others. Um, I got scolded multiple times, just like I was trying to buy... Not a lot of stuff, just buy like just one cheap movie, and I still get yelled at for doing it during the month of December. So I'm not going to be buying movies in the month of December anymore for myself. So just a little heads up, but these are the ones I've gotten from Walmart. Now here are the two I got from Target. Um, I got Hacksaw Ridge. Um, I usually don't watch a lot of war movies. Um, even I mentioned I watched Lone Survivor. Like this and... Lone Survivor, the ones I've liked so far. Um, Hacksaw Ridge is the one I really liked with um, Andrew Garfield. and Very, very, very brutal movies. Only for people 18 and up. But I'll talk about this once I get around reviewing it. And I got Hotel Transylvania, which um, when I moved here, like I've never seen any of these movies before. And then when I moved here and started watching them, like I really enjoyed them. I like both the Hotel Transylvania movies. 
I still have to pick up part two and three though. Um, part two is always on cheap price at Walmart for five dollars. I gotta get that one at some point, and maybe I'll get the um, part three once it goes down in price. And this one's based on the score trials I got from the Goodwill for I think two forty seven something like that. Um, this is the second Maze Runner movie, if I'm not clear, and Death Cure is the last one. Um, I like both of these movies. Um, I'm trying to figure out which one's my favorite, but sometime in the future I'll do a review talking about both of these movies, like like reviewing the trilogy as a whole. Now, this is the recent one I got from the Goodwill the other night, and they had a 50% off sale on the DVDs or the media stuff, and this is the movie that I could have sworn I had in my collection like in my DVD collection at the old house where I originally lived in Pennsylvania and I realized I don't think I ever had it. I got it for a dollar forty eight which is probably a good deal. Um, it'd be the same price as the Maze Runner Score Charles DVD but this one I think is a great price. I got Spider-Man 2. My Spider-Man collection is now complete. Well mainly the same Raimi ones and Spider-Man Homecoming. Um, the Amazing Spider-Man movies aren't awful. I just, I'm just not in a rush to add them to my collection. I don't think I will, but um, this is the recent one I got, and um, that's pretty much the DVDs I've gotten over the last few months. So um, just a test here to test out my um, my webcam. Um, hopefully, you know, I'm in sync. Hopefully, um, you know, the picture looks okay, and hopefully, it goes in widescreen. Like, I'm not sure. This is my first time using this webcam video. Um, and uh, well, we'll see how this one goes and maybe I'll replace the the camera I was using the Nikon camera to do DC sitting here in vlogs but if it doesn't go to widescreen I'll have to go back to the just a handheld camera I'm mainly using for vlogging and stuff but this is just a test here anyway um, thank you so much for watching and um, I hope this camera works alright um, right now I'm skeptical but hey at least I have something up for you like the last video of 2018 and I'll see you guys in 2019 adios adios no adios this will get a little used to